Hey, good morning. We have a lot going on this morning from uh, winter weather to flooding in Sioux Falls. A lot of major roads, 41st Street, 57th Street closed due to flooding. We've had about uh, two and a half inches of rain in Sioux Falls in the last couple of days on top of a lot of snow and there's nowhere for that rain to go. Big problems. Also winter weather. We have an upgrade here. Uh, all of the counties that were in that winter storm warning have now been upgraded to a blizzard warning. Sioux Falls uh, still in a winter weather advisory that's in effect and from uh, 10 this morning until 7 o'clock tonight, rain will change to snow, maybe a couple of inches here in Sioux Falls. Wind gusts to 60 plus miles per hour likely here through the day today. We do have a lot of flooding around Sioux Falls. Cami Raisler is live this morning. She is at 41st Street where it is completely flooded. Cami, fill us in. What's happening over there? Is KSFY Morning News. Hey, good morning. It's 827 from flooding to blizzard conditions across the region. A major winter storm is impacting a large part of our region. This is a live shot from Aberdeen where strong uh, 60 plus mile per hour wind gusts this morning are creating blizzard conditions, especially out in some of the rural areas. We have a lot going on this morning. A lot of flooding in Sioux Falls, uh, flooding in northeastern Nebraska, US Highway 281 and the uh, dam just south of Spencer. Nebraska has uh, the dam has apparently failed and the road highway 281 is uh, completely washed out according to a radio station in O'Neill, Nebraska. The National Weather Service uh, reporting that uh, the dam has failed. Flood warnings there. Uh, I 90 is closed uh, west of Chamberlain because of blizzard conditions. Uh, no travel advised or roads closed across much of central and northern South Dakota this morning. The wind is going to be the big deal today with gusts of uh, up to 60 or more miles per hour and that's going to cause some big problems. Before we talk about that, I'm going to give you the full rundown hour by hour in a minute. Let's go live to Cami Raisler in Sioux Falls, where uh, we've had over two and a half inches of rain on top of a lot of snow that's still on the ground, and that does not uh, end up well for uh, folks who want to travel. A lot of flooded basements and Cami, a lot of flooded roads. Yeah, including 41st Street, one of the main streets in Sioux Falls, completely flooded this morning. 